father of lamb is going to touch you. Hmm? Blood of lamb. I'm talking to blood of lamb. Jesus Christ that shed blood for you. Huh? It's going to cover all of you. Why? The Saturday this week is Passover. Passover. Passover that had happened ancient time in Nissan year, which was Jewish calendar. Nissan means miracle. Oh, hallelujah. Miracle going to happen this week in Passover period. Hallelujah. Oh, I'm telling you. Oh, oh you'll be blessed. Hallelujah. We live in fast to face, fast paced, paced. Okay. Technological world. It seems the speed of life very, very fast. Speed of life and intensity of activities had accelerated. You understand what I'm saying? Because you're feeling now every day's life. I feel. Sometimes I feel dizzy because technology is developing day by day, year and year. All right. It is no wonder that many people experience extreme worry, anxiety, apprehension. People too much worry about it. Just, uh, they feel stress in everyday life. Stress, which is the uh, main suspect. That is big problem, stress, to everybody in modern times. That take out this spirit, our enemy. Yes, stress is to go and by the blood of Jesus Christ. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Oh, stress free. You and me, stress free. Oh, if you listen carefully to this message today, your stress, uh, everything you feel, it, 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 the blood, your life, it will be gone. We, listen, just this stress every day can kill you. Hmm? But, Stress. Bye bye. No more stress. Because you are led by Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Give me glory. We commute in congested traffic. We interact with the carnal bodily thing. Uh, the people who divide and argument against you. 
that you feel the stress. We face financial, social, personal, and the job related problems. All those stress the issue of crime and the violence playing our city and the national. Hmm? How are you and your family coping with, struggling with this pressure you feel? Challenge, face of daily life. Hmm? Let me tell you the something. According to the National Institute for Mental Health, anxiety disorder affects about 40 billion billion American adults aged 18 years and old. In a given year, causing them to fulfill the with fearfulness and uncertainty. Hmm? It, anxiety disorders are the common mental illness. Costing, listen, costing of this more than 42 billion year, almost one third of the country's 148 billion total mental bill. Are you listening? All right. Okay. Can you survive? In troubles time, tough times, this world, your Bible gives us hundreds of promises from the God and the Bible. That's I will tell you. Huh? How can we cope with our stress? We have to fight. This enemy, oh, with God's promise, hallelujah. Firstly, claim God's promise. You know, when we were children, your father gave the promise. Hmm? I think you remember, I remember. We looked for the to the fulfillment of this <coughs> promise. But in this case, we have to search the Bible of this precious promise. Hmm? We have a Heavenly Father who knows our deeds and promise to fulfill them. We know our Father is going to give you answer you are asking. He is going to give you good things. Oh, hallelujah. That is a priceless blessing. Hallelujah. Oh, my, 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 my. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you. Pray the Lord. Secondly, 
Pray. Every day. I know you do pray. We need to pray every day. Paul exhorts us. Pray without ceasing. Hmm? Pray constantly. Yes. Yes, I do. I know you do. We can survive in tough times if we cry out to our Lord. God going to answer to you. God the Father, heaven will respond to you. You will hear the voice in heaven. Get down on your knees to pray to the Lord. Daily A man after God's heart, God's own heart, oh, like you. Then he prayed three times a day. Huh? I, I'm going to give you the scripture. Then he prayed some. 55 chapter 16 to 17. As for me, I will call upon the God. Thank you, Lord. Oh, oh, I love David. Oh, my brother David. You prayed. I want to learn from you. Prayed three times a day. And the Lord shall. Save me, Lord, who shall save you. Like David got the answer from God because he had prayed three times, three times, evening, morning, at noon. Hmm? I'll pray and cry out aloud. And he shall hear the, my voice. That's what he said. Huh? Or, uh, you know, uh, I can tell you another man, as an example, three times. Uh, you know, uh, Daniel. Daniel prayed three times. Hallelujah. You know the story, Daniel. Uh, the key to pray is uh, constancy. Keep going and uh, praying from your heart. God look at your heart. God now look at the, the out worldly. God look at your mind. Hallelujah. Pray the Lord. Amen. Oh my mama. We need to constantly exercise your face. Exercise your face. Hallelujah. Day after day. Week after week. Hallelujah. My my God. Oh my my God. Thank you. Oh, 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 are you are you hear me? Oh, oh, oh I want you to listen. I want you to listen carefully. Okay. Oh, oh, totally. Maintain a positive attitude, positive thinking. Keep going on positive thinking. That is very, very important to your keeping on pace. 
Hallelujah. And that overcome the stress our enemy. We got to be maintain positive attitude. Hallelujah. How? Along with your prayer every day, three times every day. We need to persevere in maintaining our positive attitude. Hallelujah. We overcome anxiety by the sharing our inmost thought and concerns with God in prayer. Hmm? Oh, oh, I feel so good. I know you feel it. It's cold. Hmm? We exercise positive attitude in our prayer by thanking God. Thanking God every day. Thank, thank, thank. Stress going out. Oh, my God. Come to your blessing, you have the receive. Mm, you will be strong and your mouth will be opened. That thanking to God, stress your enemy. No more without the hallelujah. Oh, my, 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 hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Pray the Lord. Oh, okay. Fourthly, read the Bible every day. Scripture. Huh? God reveals. Oh, oh. God reveals to you. Truth. Truth. You you want to hear whole from holy word, living word. This is spoken word you are reading now. Let me tell you. Spoken word. It come. Ah, no, sorry. This written word. You got Bible. This come into spoken word into your mind if you read and touch from spoken word inscribed to living word in your heart. That miracle, miracle going to happen. I promise you. God promise you. God promise you. Hallelujah. We can know the soul of God when we read the Bible. How do we know the will of God? How do we know the soul of the God? If you don't read the Bible. Hmm? As you study the word of God, huh? Bible will give you more face to face life challenge. Hallelujah. Oh, my, 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 thank you, Lord. Bible say, Romans 10, chapter 17, face comes here, here by the word of God. Gotta hear the word of God. Thank you, Lord. Um, lastly, care for others. Take care of other people. The second great commandment is you shall love your neighbor as yourself. Verse 23, chapter 39. Hmm? 
when you focus on need of others, other people, you want to help. Listen, listen, my brother and sister, that's so big. Oh, oh you, you want to miss this word. I know you don't want to miss to hear what I'm saying. Your personal stress reduced, not only reduced, it's gone, it's gone. Hmm? When you help other people, there are many, many ways to help other people through the prayer, through the helping, to something you want, like a material thing, and visit to the people and education, many, many things you can do as you want. Why? Why do this is very very good thing for the Christian, helping other people. Because you are practicing a great spiritual commandment. Hallelujah. Oh, uh, did you hear what I'm saying? Uh -huh. I say again, you are doing what? Helping others. You are practicing now a great spiritual commandment, second commandment. God love, God like it. Jesus want to do helping people. Remember, the supreme way of life Jesus taught us it is more blessed to give than to receive. Acts 20, chapter 35. And another scripture I want to tell you. Mark 10, chapter 45. I did not come to be helped. I come to serve. I did not come to be served. I come to serve people and gave life as a ransom to many, many people, including you and me. Oh, thank you, thank you, Lord. Precious blood of the Lamb of God. Flow. You, your family, around you, everything flow to you. Cover me. No weapon of anything against you come to you. You, no other language that divide you, curse you, come to you. They will be destroyed. If somebody, whoever, hurt you, blood of the Lamb of God passed them. Oh, pass over, covered you, you'll be making hedge around you and your house, everything you are doing now. I guarantee. God promise you in this season, this time, God's time, God's moment, God's cycle, pass over 
that Lamb of God. Brother, Lamb of God going to help you, cover you. Hallelujah. Oh, we all need to follow Christ's example of serving, helping, oh, caring for other people. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Pray the Lord. Oh, my Lord, thank you. Blood of the Lamb of Passover covered all your house, everything, protect you, your business, your child, whatever you do, God will bless you if you keep the five things which I told you huh? that your breakthrough which take out break stress and every your enemy giant going to be destroyed if you do the five things I was preaching. Thank you, Lord, pray the Lord, give me glory. Thank you, hallelujah. Oh, I'm thankful to the Lord. Oh, I pray for you. I pray for you. We are we are really, really living in the last days. You know, we need God's help. We need, we absolutely need God's providence and guidance. I believe, I am believe. Oh, my friend came. To help me and and God is going to bless you this time Passover God's moment this week Saturday yeah. is that blood of a realm of God will protect you Really, that you want to, to see the miracle. Miracle going to happen. I guarantee Bible promise you. Keep this promise by your face. I, I believe. Oh, I can't wait next week. Thank you, Lord. Bye-bye. Pray the Lord. Amen.